Justin Bieber was accused of sexual assault by two women on Twitter. The women claim the assaults happened in 2014 and 2015. Whether we like it or not, we need to take these claims seriously. Justin Bieber is an alleged rapist. The pop star has been accused of sexual assault by two women on Twitter. One woman claims she was assaulted in 2014 the other in 2015. Whether we like it or not, these claims need to be taken seriously. One accusation against Justin Bieber was anonymous the other wasn't the first accusation made against Bieber was made from a so-called burner account on Twitter. Bieber's first accuser, who only went by Danielle, said that the alleged assault happened when Bieber was still with Selena Gomez. Justin was with his former ex-girlfriend for a concert in Houston, TX. He had pushed me down on the bed after about 10 minutes of sitting up, got on top of me, started kissing me down my neck and made his way down to my stomach. Danielle's account of the alleged assault subsequently went viral. And her testimony did not go over well with Belly Ebers. His second accuser is being doubted shortly after Danielle came forward with her story about Justin Bieber, an influencer named Cuddy came forward with hers. Almost instantly, Belly Ebers cast aspersions on her story, as well. Despite the vicious attacks, Cuddy stands by her story. Bieber has been quite problematic in the past. And this is something that even his most devout fans have to accept. By no means, however, is this to suggest that Bieber is absolutely guilty. His manager denies the claims. However, we as a society have to address the disturbing sexual assault and rape statistics. More than 90% of sexual assaults go unreported. And this is to say nothing of the countless sexual assaults that never get prosecuted, nor of the rape kits that remain untested. It doesn't matter if you're a Justin Bieber fan or not. We need to take rape and sexual assault claims seriously, no matter the end result.